Welcome back to the Marley Super Saiyan play. From the last part, we finally beat the boss of Tihi Valley in a way that I didn't really do before. Okay, now we're in Fungi Town. This place is full of toads. Now, we could look around. Like, let's look around for a minute. Like, right here, we have a toad. Uh, yeah, we're guarding Princess Peach, but she's not here right now. See, this is a whole entire toad, and they're based in a tree, and, yeah, well, and here's an item shop. I'll go in here and get some items. I'll see you guys in one second. All right, bought us a few, uh, a few mushrooms, a few, uh, little few nuts. Cause now nuts are for sale here. Okay, let's just go. There's the armor shop, but we don't have enough money because I wasted all on items. So the main part of this game is we want to go into the arcade. Hey, dude. Yeah, I'll give you a free invincibility shroom, okay. Now, for people that want to know, this, I'm about to have the biggest fangasm of all time. Guess what? It's Gino! Gino, my home dog, you're back to, to proclaim! And look, it's doing the invincibility from Yoshi's Island, too. Oh, the nostalgia. Not only is it Yoshi's Island, but it's also Gino. Okay, now the rules of this game, it's just gotta do the color that it does. gonna get 200 and it's pretty much it's pretty simple don't do the bombs it's pretty much it it's really simple but I haven't done this one in a while so and yeah about a few minutes and if you do the bomb then well oh and I'm forgetting the buttons already you just gotta do the A and B button this one isn't really this mini game isn't really that bad to be honest I mean sure there are some mini games that are worse than this but this one isn't really that bad it's actually playable Except for the fact that I'm sucking at because I haven't played it for a few years. Or I can easily beat this minigame really quickly. This is the main part of the game. You just want to do this minigame. Then you get to the next story event. See? See, we're already at 200. See, it, wasn't, see, it was fast. Really quick. And this is the only time we're going to play this minigame. So just, just if you want to play this minigame forever and ever and always and always and always, forever, forever, forever. Just, uh, you do it yourself. Wow, 275. That was my highest high score ever. What do I win, Gino? Missions. Good, and now we get the invincibility shroom that I've heard so much about, even though I just heard about. Here you go. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Hey, it looks like that mushroom that we did during the boss fight. That might be bad. Is it delectable? Oh, God. Mario? Mario? Oh no, Mario! Mario! Mario's dead! Oh god, Mario's dead! Oh god. We must more. It's like it runs. It's Mars the Mushroom Kingdom all over again. Oh, he has only a. He has bean fever in all capitals! Oh. Well, we've been eating mushrooms from this region, so. How can that be bad? I mean, we've been eating the nuts from this region. I mean, how? Why? It should have been like they should have made that a really. He'll turn into a bean. Oh God, a bean! No, they should have done. They should have, like if you ate anything from the bean, it became like a nut or something. Cause nuts are common in this game, and they should have done the same thing. Could could have gotten ill for like a turn or something, but they really only use it for story storyline. Chabby grass. Okay, Luigi has to go. Oh yeah, I want to prove that I am the best. This is this is the third time you get to play as Luigi, and I think this is my fit. Oh shit! Tap by monsters, head to broken bare flesh. Oh god. Now Luigi's freaking scared. He's doing Luigi's mansion face. But you're Luigi. Um, Peach, you don't know how scared Luigi is. And he doesn't want to fight a monster. He's not brave enough to be Mario. Even though this, this quest is going to prove he is as. No, it's not. <laughs> no. I just got to tell you guys something. This is my favorite part of the entire game. It's my favorite segment. <laughs> I mean, it, it just proves. It just uses good character for Luigi. He doesn't freaking talk. Okay, I'm scared. We just can't do anything because he's freaking scared. Now, what you, now everybody might be saying, what are we supposed to do now, Mega Mike? What are we supposed to do now? We can't jump. Well, it's quite simple, really. First, you gotta go down here. It's going way too slow. Let's just, let's just fast forward. We want to go into this house. The one that's only accessible because we can... And meet Kamek. 
Well, it's not really cam, it just looks like him. Take a deep breath. Okay, this guy does look like Kamek. It looks like Kamek with a with a white mage roof from Final Fantasy on. I mean, it's really, really weird. He wants to turn us into Mario, or she. You are Mario. You are Mario. Mario is you. This is why I like this part. Coming Mario. You are turning into Mario. More and more Mario. You are almost Mario. <laughs> Quite nearly Mario. Aya! Thank you, Magikoop. I don't think we fight any Magikoopas in the game. I am Mario. Am I Mario? Come this way. Holy shit, I'm Mario! Clothes are not red. You are Mario. Yes, let's go. I am Mario. Let's go to the village. We are no longer playing as Luigi. I went. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, we can't do There's one of the pipes. The warp point pipes. I forgot where half of them are, but there's one of them. If you're keeping track, that's one of the warp point pipes. Like, let's go down, let's go down back to the, oh god, Teehee Valley. And, uh, let's go back to Teehee Valley, god forbid, and go to those rooms that are conveniently in Teehee Valley. Oh god, why are we going back to Teehee Valley? Why? I just got out of here. Yeah, you couldn't go through this area before because you, you only you need one person. But we're Mario. We are Mario. You know what's funny? Like, he should be Mario, but he should be doing the Mario thing, not the Luigi thing. I don't think there are any enemies here. If there are, I don't know. <laughs> what do you know? It's a maze. Good. Yeah, let's go. This is one of my favorite segments in the game. I just remember this place being so freaking memorable. I mean, it proves that Luigi can be like Mario, even though it technically is Mario at this point. Okay, where is the... The... The temple is right... It's not right here. T Valley can go suck my balls. Why don't you go suck my balls, T Valley? There's no enemies in T Valley, which is good. Fuck you. Okay. Are we in T Valley? Hey, look, it's a Montemole. Wait, we're not T. We're not. We're not the ruins yet. To the ruins of T Valley. I sure not T Valley anymore. Wait, did I go the right way? I'm not even sure anymore. Yeah, we, we went the right way. We are in. We are going to the Groff ruins. Hey you. Just hit this thing and it's really simple. I don't think you can fail this. You can just don't hit the red ones. Don't hit the red ones or you'll fail. This one you might fail at because it's going way too freaking slow. There we go, we opened the ruins! Yay! Mario opened the ruins! Mario opened the ruins! I mean, Luigi opened the ruins! Now we just gotta press the button, and we've entered the ruins. So, okay, so to the next part where Luigi, I mean Mario, goes into the ruins in order to get the Krabby Grass in order to save Mario. See you around, guys. Bye.